Hi everyone. So, um, I actually just checked my email and it looks like my Shaleen Extreme for the Beach Body Challenge has been shipped. So, I will be getting my, getting it by, I think they said the 16th. And my, uh, some of my eyelashes fell off today. See, I have this really, I have a space right here. <laughs> and then of course this eye, it's all kinds of wonky. I can get a refill, but they're kind of starting to really aggravate me. So, yeah, don't laugh at me. I have to go to bed. Oh, hold on. There we go. Um, I have to go to bed because I have to get up really early. Really? Okay. What else, Spunky? Spunkalunka. Spunkalunka, Spunkalunka, Spunkalunka. What's the matter? Oh, and there he goes. <laughs> anyway. Meow. Meow. Um. So yeah, my Shaleen Extreme has been mailed or shipped. They said I think by the 16th it should be here. I'm looking very forward to getting it so that I can actually start working out. And I didn't make my bed this this morning, so it's a mess in here. I don't care at the moment. So it is 12:30. I'm actually going to bed now because I'm exhausted. It's been a very long day because I had to babysit, as I said on today's vlog or vlog, I mean, and oh. Uh oh. So yes, another busy day in the champion household. Oh Christ. Um and there goes my cell phone. Um got up early this morning and my bed has wheels on it. <laughs> and if I move around a lot when I'm sleeping, it rolls away from the wall which has that. Um, anyway, so, oh God, all right. We're just gonna put that right there for a minute. Um, got up real early and dealt with the bug man. Um, and ran all over, pro all over Rhode Island, honestly. Oh, wow. Ran all over Providence and Rhode Island and Warwick and all kinds of things. Um, God, what did we do? Uh, I forget what we did today, honestly. Um, I really forget what we did, what we started off with. Forget what we started off with, but, uh, We went to the dollar store. We went to Walmart. That's what we did. We started off with Walmart. Um, 
because I had to get batteries for my camera because the batteries died already for the other ones that came with it and uh, then we went then we went to lunch at Wendy's um, then we went to the dollar store and then we we did a whole bunch of stuff and then oh and then we went to draw on fabrics because we got I got more yarn because I've started knitting and I've actually gotten it uh, I've actually done this much <sighs> on something um, of course it's only this wide by this wide but um, I'll figure something out to do with it um, and then we came home and I did Skye's hair and makeup for her dance which she loved um, and then I've been kind of just sitting around all night was on the was on Skype for hours with my best friend um, and then tomorrow hopefully she's getting a microphone so that we can actually speak instead of me speaking and her typing um, that's a pain in the ass really um, we're supposed to be getting snow tomorrow it's already started raining um, let's hope it stays rain because I'm also supposed to get a tattoo um, if not I really don't want to reschedule I really wanted to get the tattoo tomorrow um, I'm crossing my fingers Anyway, I am beat. It's been a long day. I am going to bed. So, I will see you guys, hopefully, at the tattoo shop tomorrow. <laughs> hey, YouTube. So, I am laying here, getting ready to get a tattoo. See, that's the stencil. Oh, crap, my freaking strap is coming off. And <laughs> there's the stencil. Yay! And there's my tattoo artist. Hi! <laughs> so, yay! I was excited. I've been counting down for like, what, two weeks now? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> two weeks. The countdown. Yeah, I'll be like, I posted on her page. Two weeks? Two weeks until I can eat? Ten days. Ten days. <laughs> we almost had a snowstorm. I know, then we almost had a snowstorm, which you can see what happened there. Absolutely freaking nothing. Nope. <laughs> and I almost wasn't be able, able to be here today because, oh, uh, almost, almost snowstorm. So completely missed us. It just rained. Thank God. This. Thank Goddess. <laughs> Either or. Either or. So she's putting her machine together. They were there with me when I got this. Oh, yeah. Yes, this thing. <laughs> forearm. Yes, my forearm. So. Yay! I figured since I hadn't done anything yesterday and pretty much nothing today, I figured that I should... Well, I meant vlogging, but yeah, that that works too. <laughs> Get that dude. Um, no, but I figured that I would vlog a little bit while I was here, so you guys could see what I actually did today. Instead of me sitting at home on the computer or playing with my kids or my cats or knitting. Or knitting with my cats. Or knitting with my cats. <laughs> yeah, that works too. Okay. Okay, so we got done the outline. The other outline. Almost done. <coughs> and yes, this is the only time you will ever see my stomach. That's the outline so far. And you guys will see the finished product when it's finished. <laughs> okay, guys, so there's the finished product. Nice. Okay, let's try that again. So I just get back, I just get home from the, um, 
the tattoo shop. And about 10 minutes into me being on Facebook, I start seeing messages about Whitney Houston's death. It's really sad. It's really sad. I grew up listening to her. You know, one of the first albums that I ever got was her, the one that she had um, with you know how how well I know and I want to dance with somebody and it's just it's just sad my mom took me to see the bodyguard when I danced I used to dance to Queen of the Night it was one of my things um, one of my skits acts performances whatever you want to call it it's just a really sad thing you know everybody that I grew up watching or um, listening to is croaking I mean Corey Haim and Michael Jackson um, I forget her name, Brittany. Oh my God, my name. Her name is. Drawing, I'm drawing a name a blank on her name right now. And now friggin' Whitney. Oh, and then Heavy D a few months ago, or whenever it was. And while he asked it, losing him was a pretty big blow to the music industry because he was so, you know, he was influential in the music industry and stuff he wasn't like my my genre of music um so this this is pretty bad but rest in peace Whitney you'll be missed